Awesome, guys. So the next little exercise I really need you to pay attention to, and this is my favorite, I dig this, is I want you to do a Facebook Live on some of your biggest fears. The top three, four, or five biggest fears. Jumping out of an airplane, holding a snake, doing a Facebook Live, singing in public, dancing in public, whatever it is for you, it's got to involve something like that. Why? Yeah, you guessed it, because we're going to be nailing some of these fears. Trust me, that's where the growth is. And I know it's daunting, I know it's scary. I remember years ago doing a massive... Uh, empowering statement and empowering ritual and singing and dancing in the middle of Federation Square in Melbourne. Like, there was hundreds of people everywhere. Yeah, I was getting looked at. Yeah, people laughed. Yeah, people pointed. You know what? I had a lot that stayed behind and asked me questions too. I had people that clapped when I finished. One lesson for me is I realized that it's okay to be me. It's okay to do an empowering ritual, an empowering mantra amongst hundreds of people. It's okay to dance at the end of it and sing at the end of it. Other people started to sing and dance as well, right? There was, it, my, I won't lie to you, there was a lot of fear beforehand. There's a lot of like, oh my God, what am I going to do? I'm going to get arrested. People are going to laugh. People are going to judge me. Yeah, that all happened, but I didn't get arrested. But yeah, people laughed. People judged me. People loved it too. And you know what I learned is that most people that kind of looked, they're like, oh yeah, that's cool. And they just kept going. And they may have gone, what a goose. It's cool. I don't know. Maybe they didn't. I had people that stayed behind and wanted to talk to me as well. One major lesson is I realized that it's okay to be you. It's okay to, to be what you need to be. And when you push through a fear, it's magical. Like it's, You just feel like this incredible sense of just relief and pride and you're just ready to take on the world. This is what it takes because you can't begin to think you can lead someone else down that path until you crush your fears. So this is really cool. Three, that's two, three, four or five of your fears. Eric said, holding a snake, jumping out of an airplane, singing in public, dancing in public, doing a Facebook Live, I don't know, whatever it might be for you, I want you to post it in the Facebook group. And we're going to make sure that in the next three months, we nail at least three of these things. So one a month we're going to nail. So start backing yourself, start prepping, and we're going to do it together. It's going to be awesome.